It is almost two months since the death of Sam Pamwenya, a Zambian student who died in China in a road mishap. The family has continued struggling to repatriate his remains due to financial constraints. The family's difficulties were brought to the attention of government, which made a commitment of assisting the family. Kapiri Member of Parliament Stanley Kakubo, who is also Minister of Foreign Affairs and International Cooperation, had indicated that the process to assist the family had started. However, despite the assurance, the process seems to be taking forever and the family is now worried. The deceased family, Morgan Mwenya, says they are slowly losing patience, asking government to expedite the process. So the reason why we have been trying to communicate with him is because of the same, but he doesn't pick up calls. And we just hear that he was in Kapilin Ponshi. Last week on Saturday, he was in Kapilin Ponshi. He went to the west part of, you know, Kapilin Ponshi. That's where he, he, he went, but he was in Kapil. But initially, two weeks before, after my son died, he promised that he was going to come home so that we, we discuss with the family and that one. But he has never done that, not even a single day. He says, time has really gone by and hosting a funeral for a long period of time is expensive. He has since appealed to President Hagainde Hichlema to intervene in this matter. You know, to host the funeral for two months, just a, just a two days, just a, two, a normal, you know, you know, uh, launching just a normal funeral for two to three days, two to three days, people are able to, you know, to 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 lose about fifteen thousand or so to twenty thousand. Just three days. But now we are talking about two months. If he, if well wishers do not come on board, the people are sympathizing with us because we don't work. We can't move. We are talking about losing my firstborn son. My firstborn biological son. It's not somebody from far away from us. And the reason why we engaged the government, we really indicated that we have got no capacity. Sam Pamanya was a fourth-year civil engineer student and was almost graduating before he met his untimely death. The family is looking forward to giving their son a befitting send-off. Victoria Kayeye Yambani. Demon News.